So here we are in the Heddle Shipyard in St. Catharines, Ontario, talking to people that build ships, and I want to tell you, it is an exciting time here. Great people, what an energy, what a vibe. I can tell you, I can feel the excitement in the air. So why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? Hi, so I'm, my name is Chelsea Davis. I'm, I'm a project engineer here, but I've actually um, managed a few of the projects in Port Weller. Um, originally from Newfoundland, so I actually started off my career with Heddle Shipyards in Newfoundland when we had a facility out there. So I spent about three years there, then I moved abroad for a couple years to get some more experience, and um, now I'm back here. I've been here for about two years now. Chelsea, what's been your academic journey to get here? So I actually studied at Memorial University in Newfoundland. I did um, ocean and naval architectural engineering. So um, my biggest background is in Navarre and doing a lot of structural steel work. It must be kind of fun to be here at Heddle. Pretty exciting things are happening here right now. Absolutely, yeah. Um, ever since I've been with Heddle, even back on the East Coast, it's definitely been something that I've really enjoyed and I can't wait to see what, what comes in the future. You get a real feeling of family around here. Everybody kind of, they talk about uh, working here differently than people talk about going to work every day. Mm -hmm. Where does that come from? Where does that sense of family come from? I, I just feel like we all have each other's backs here. Like. Um, where we did start off as a very small company, you kind of get that that warmer feel. You're you're a person, not a number, yeah. which is the reason why I've wanted to stick around for so long. And you know, the other thing too is we've talked to a lot of people, and they've started at kind of entry level jobs and have worked their way up. Heddle's given them the opportunity to grow into leadership roles and take more responsibility. That's kind of a cool thing to do. Yeah, absolutely. Um, when I started in the East Coast, I was kind of more of like a design engineer. From there, I moved up to, to project engineering. I've gotten some smaller jobs, and um, ever since I've been here, I've started managing some of the big leakers coming through. So it's definitely a very exciting time. Did you ever think that you'd find yourself in St. Catharines, Ontario, managing huge projects like a lake boat coming in, and now Terry Fox just around the corner? It must be exciting. Um, actually, no. Being from Newfoundland, um, coming to Ontario is usually the last thing on people's minds, but I'm very happy I came here. I've gained so much experience. Um, th there's only one shipyard in, in Newfoundland, so yeah. it's it's been super exciting being here and seeing some of the bigger boats. It must feel great to be a part of that, right? Knowing that you're refurbishing ships and building new ships. And, uh, you know, some of those ships, like the Terry Fox, are in the service of our country. Those men and women go to sea every day and serve our country. But in many respects, you're enabling that. You're making that happen. So you're serving our country. How does that feel? Do you feel the pride there? Yeah, for sure. You definitely feel that pride. Um, one of the first Canadian Coast Guard vessels I worked on from being here was the Pierre Radisson. And ever since then, I've been wanting to get more and more experience on these Coast Guard vessels because they are very cool projects to work on. Well, this is what shipbuilding looks like in Canada, and Heddle Shipyards is leading the way. Thank you very much for being in conversation. Thank you for having me.